Another TRX. This one's a fun one. Last time the engine blew at 560 miles. 6.2 liter supercharged Hemi. Zero to 60 in 4.7. I'm bringing this one to Vegas. I'm picking up a new Dodge Ram 2500. I'm somewhere in Iowa, past Des Moines. This truck is sick though. Really sick, really fast to drive, of course. Got 300 miles under my belt today. Starting the trip with 1,832.3 miles. Pretty awesome. Driving through here. All mountains, of course. <clears throat> All the rafting, gold mine tours, ATV tour signs, cannabis shops. It's pretty awesome to be down on the bottom. One day I drove 15,042 miles. It's my personal best. I made it to Zion Park National Park in Utah. It's the third biggest Fairfield in the world. Pool right there. Wow. I'm kind of bummed that I'm almost all the way through Utah. But it was super dark last night. Unbelievable. I couldn't see any of this last night. Unbelievable. Just, Minnesota is so boring. I used to hate driving through Iowa, now I hate Nebraska. Just unbelievable. Oh my gosh, this is gorgeous out here. Wow. Super cool. I'm in the middle of, I don't know where I am, the Mesa Canyon. Unbelievable. So cool. Utah is amazing. Gotta go through Arizona next in about an hour. Man, last night when I came in here at three in the morning, I was like, I better not fall off that cliff. Was I right? Unreal. It's like driving like this for six hours. Made it to Arizona. Only for 27 miles and I'm in Nevada. But this is gorgeous too. Unbelievable. This is for my memories. I'm gonna have to bring Addie and Andrea to Zion, that's for sure. That's where I woke up today. Unbelievable though. Just can't get over how awesome this canyon driving is. Utah and Arizona are pretty kick butt. Can't wait to get back to Denver. Uh, Vail later today. Drive through there again, but I kind of like the desert. It's amazing. Andrea, we got to come back. Oh my God, it's like doesn't even look real. Unbelievable, unbelievable, unbelievable. Like how far am I going down? What in the world? following the water to make it easy. What in the world? 
on Rio. It's been curvy like this for seriously eight hours. My trip ended with 1,699 miles on the TRX. So I just dropped the TRX off. Look what I gotta bring back. Woo! The brand new 2020 Proctor XL. That's what I'm bringing back. 38 miles on it. Done with the TRX. Put about 1,700 miles on that. That thing is amazing. I'm in Las Vegas right now. Look at this piece. 30 inch wheels. That's gonna be a fun one. Hopefully it drives nice with those new big tires. Going back. In Arizona now. Trying to get to Utah as fast as possible. And home. that I drove through here last night. I couldn't see anything except for the headlights. Pretty awesome though. So pretty. That red in the rocks like that. Devil's Canyon. It's a little viewing area. Pretty incredible. I don't want to get too close. Wow. What is up with all these things? All these little bumps. Out of the ground.
getting some feel. This is crazy. It's like one pedestal. Let's see. Two, three, four, five, six. All these little like outlet areas is pretty crazy. I've never even seen a prospector. These tires are as high as my waist, no joke. I don't really like race trucks, but when they do them stock like this, it's like the perfect size and it kind of matches, doesn't look goofy, then I like them. When they do it too high, I think it's absolutely ridiculous. But since it's stock, I don't mind this. The hood is as high, the mirrors are as high as my head. It's crazy. It's crazy. Seriously, as high as my waist. It's huge. Got home and I did about 1,600 miles in this truck. 